This is what's growing inside Philippa's womb just three weeks after fertilization. Around the ball is the yolk sac, a temporary food store. Stretched across the top is the embryo itself. Within it, thousands of new cells are created every second. And somehow, they are given instructions to where they fit in. This long column is the foundation of the nervous system and the brain. The basic layout of the body is, from a very early stage, quite familiar. At six weeks, the developing spine is bent double. The bud of an arm is beginning to form near the top. This is the head. But the exact details of each embryo are unique. It's being built to a genetic blueprint which is a one-off, never tried before. Work starts at the head and progresses down. By six and a half weeks, that makes the head, on the left, disproportionately large. All four limbs have sprouted, though the right arm is hidden behind the umbilical cord. But as the embryo's genetic blueprint is brand new, it's never actually been tested. Each new step could reveal a fatal mistake and they're much more common than you might think. It's a harsh reality, but what you see here will not inevitably become a baby. Five out of six embryos will not have survived up to eight weeks in the womb. It's almost impossible to see a developing feature and not imagine it finished. But the truth is, this will only become an eye if luck stays on its side. Every moment we watch, this embryo is taking another step into uncharted territory. The embryo has reached eight weeks. It looks like it may become a boy, but in fact, what you're looking at could develop not into a penis, but a clitoris. The embryo sex is hidden. For now, both male and female look the same. Also hidden is the construction work inside the body. Millions of cells are becoming bone, lungs, and brain. At this stage, nine weeks, the stomach is producing its own digestive juices and the heart has started its vigorous pumping. We now call it not an embryo, but a fetus. But the name change doesn't mean its future is any more assured. The risk of failure still accompanies each new development. Footprints and palm prints are engraved. All the time, the work is fueled by the supply line, the umbilical cord linking the fetus to the mother. 